In this tutorial, I will teach you how to make an ink bleed using Photoshop. Let's get started. First, open a canvas where you would like to place the text. Then, type in the word that you would like to have an ink bleed effect. Once you're satisfied, you can now go ahead and convert the text to a smart object by right-clicking on the layer and select Convert to Smart Object. Now, in the menu bar, open the Filters tab and select Blur, then Gaussian Blur. Here, you can adjust the blurriness of the text, which will determine how much you would like the text to bleed into each other. Once you're satisfied, create a new fill or adjustment layer and select Threshold. Adjust the threshold amount to your liking, and when you're satisfied, you can now go ahead and open the Filters tab, select Distort, then Ripple. Now, adjust the amount of ripple to your liking. The farther you set the value to zero, the more you're going to have a more distorted effect. Once you're done, you can still adjust each settings if the results doesn't satisfy you. To adjust each effect, simply double-click on the respective effects, and to adjust the opacity, simply click on the settings icon at the end of each effect. Now, to add a displacement map, simply make a new canvas and place a grungy texture onto it before saving it to your computer as a PSD file. And open the Filters tab, select the store, and click Displace. Now, adjust the settings to your liking, but the default settings are mostly fine, so go ahead and click OK and open the PSD file of your image. You can still tweak each setting if the effect doesn't suit you. And for the finishing touches, add some paper textures and you're done. If you found this video helpful, kindly like and subscribe. And if you want to see more tutorials, turn on the notification bell so that you can be updated whenever we upload new tutorials.